Naomi says, I'm sorry. What would be bias or biased? If you're biased, then where you stand reflects or affects how you see things around you, right? Based on your opinion or how you feel about things, you might try to be honest about something, but in fact your opinion is slightly to this side or your description of this thing is slightly to one side because of where you're coming from, because of your, your values or whatever. Let me give you a couple of really simple examples that can show bias. Now, bias could be a good thing, could be a bad thing. Bias is really just being pulled to one side by something. So the classic example would be the parent of a kid who plays basketball who says, my son, to the coach, my son, he's the best player on the team. Why don't you let him play more? Why isn't he a starter? Starter is the first five people on the basketball team. Why is he the seven man? My son's the best player on the team. Now, is the son the best player on the team? Well, maybe. But it's also possible that because of the relationship between that guy and that person, the player, he thinks that. It's his son. So he's biased. What he's saying is being pulled by the fact that he has a relationship with this person. This is his son. He wants his son to play more. He wants his son to be out there on the court. He has an interest in that. And so he can't see things without having lenses on. He can't see things objectively. If he didn't have kids on the team, any kids on the team, and he was just watching the players, he would say, oh, that kid's better, that kid's worse, and he might be unbiased. If you're unbiased, that means I don't have any starting point. I don't have anything that's pulling me this way or pulling me that way. But the father does. Now, maybe he doesn't have a kid on the team, but he's still biased for another reason. Maybe no, three is his favorite number. So number three, number three is the best, best player of the team because his favorite number is three. So he's biased for a different reason. That's a very silly reason. Number three is the best. Why? Because I could be because three is my favorite number but you he wouldn't be honest about that but maybe it's subliminal or subconscious it's under the surface often a bias is something that exists down where we don't see it and when someone says you're just saying that because your favorite number is three then we say no no i'm being no oh, i'm objective no you're not no i am so when it comes to things like politics Let's say Fox News or CNN. Well, traditionally, Fox News is on the right. That's their starting point. And so often when they represent a news story, it is biased toward that perspective. In other words, you're often getting the news story not as an alien would present it. What I would like to see is an alien news reporter, right, from presenting from a spaceship totally unbiased, this is what happened. And this is what we think is going to happen next. And we're aliens and we don't care and we're unbiased. Well, we want all of humanity to die. So we're unbiased in that way. <laughs> Maybe they're biased against all of humanity, but not politically, right? But Fox News will be biased against good news for the Democrats and the liberals, right? because they are on the right. They are more conservative. And so if they see a news story that might have an angle that's bad for the other side, they'll they'll poke at that. And if it's bad for them, they'll maybe they'll maybe avoid it and pretend it doesn't exist. In the same way, CNN, for example, tends to be more on the left. So if Donald Trump does something, "Oh, can you believe Donald Trump did this? I can't believe it." But then when somebody on their side on the left does something like that, they'll say, well, what, what? Ah, man, not a big deal. Even if it's exactly the same thing. And of course I'm biased too, but to me, that's pretty obvious. I have my own political opinions. What you're hearing from me must be biased because I have opinions. 
and I have a view on things. But I think I think that it would be hard to disagree with that. That's the, for example, news media, they're biased on one side or the other. So I hope that makes it clear, Naomi. Guys, if you haven't already, I would really appreciate if you could smash the like button. If you have a zombie hand, then do it with your zombie hand. If not, just do it with your regular hand. That's fine. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe and also check out the full courses which are on sale in the links in the description. Thank you.